The Premier has sacked the board of Gladstone Ports Corporation, claiming environmental cover-ups in central Queensland and financial mismanagement. The SAC chairman says it's an insulting political manoeuvre. The Gladstone Ports Corporation is in charge of the largest dredging operation undertaken inshore from the Great Barrier Reef. But the Premier says he's not satisfied the environment's being protected or that money is being spent appropriately. This is the sort of poor and reckless financial management we cannot tolerate anymore. Campbell Newman told Parliament the government-owned corporation has a budget blowout of 36% after spending more than a million dollars on advertising, entertainment and sponsorship. It will not be tolerated and that is why there will be a change, a comprehensive change in the management of Gladstone Port. As part of a shake-up, the board's chairman, a well-known Queensland businessman, has been sacked. What insulted me about it is that, uh, firstly, a public servant rang me about eight, nine days ago to say, the government wants your resignation. I said, I'm not the resigning type, sack me. Ian Brasasco, who's also a life member of the Labor Party, has rejected the government's accusations. Would you think it's political? The corporation's dredging operation that's funded by liquefied natural gas companies has been under increasing scrutiny since a diseased fish outbreak last year. A lot of Gladstone people, as well as the commercial fishermen, are suffering really bad. So the new change, fantastic. The government has appointed the head of the National Retail Association, Mark Brodie, as the new chairman. Marlena Wop, ABC News, Gladstone.